Okay, I actually need to talk about something that another thing that bothers me. And I don't know what causes this, but it pisses me off a lot. Okay. So Oftentimes I go to sleep, I wake up in the morning and I have mucus in my throat. And the way that I can tell that I have mucus in my throat is because my throat hurts a lot. And then I cough up the mucus and the pain is gone. Like if I get rid of all the mucus, then the pain is not there. But it fucking sucks because I'm sitting there feeling terrible. Like my throat hurts a lot. Like I can drink stuff to try and help. But the only thing that helps is coughing up like massive fucking mucus that's hurting my throat for no fucking reason. And I don't know why a shit ton of this stuff like gathers up in my throat overnight. I fucking hate it and I don't want it to. It all it just it it sucks. It fucking sucks. Let's see what's got here. Able to solve a difficult problem. Knowledge increased. When was the knowledge going to increase again? Your knowledge increased again. I just want to know like what those stats are at right now. Because I think there's like about five levels to our emotional stats. Annika's watching TV today as usual. If you want, you can change the channel. No, I'm good. Annika looks bored. Oh. Let's well try a magic trick. Ooh. So I just show her a magic trick. You put the rubber band on your index finger and middle finger. Okay. You also hook it on the ring finger and pinky without Nanako noticing. What are you doing? When you open up your hand, the hand you had closed tightly. Fuck. Fuck. Okay, so basically you let go of your hand and it switched to the other two fingers. Nanika's laughing cheerfully. Night continues. I fucked up. I forgot that I have auto scroll on for the text. Oh, fucking this guy. School camp will be this week, will be taking place this weekend. Remember, this isn't like ordinary camping. It's going to be a place of education to wind up the lazy ass minds you get from screwing around all the time. You know you all depend on other people too much. That's why you jerk offs have all this spare time. Oh, he'll do it someday, or she's doing it for me. I bet that's all you think about. Let's take a closer look at it, shall we? What's the root of the word penned? Hanamura! Stop smiling and answer! First of all, how could I be smiling in- <laughs> How could I be smiling in this class? And second, this has nothing to do with logic. Penned, eh? Words with penned in them, huh? I have no clue. Dovo, help me out. Dovo, help me out here. To hang. You give me the answer things correct. Ah, pretty sound, Hanamura. Or should I be praising nightly? You're right, the word penned means to hang. Like Hanamura was too tongue tied to explain. Words like penda and pendulum are good examples. Those girls who got mur. Oh. That was fucked up. <sniffs> Fucking asshole. Sweet, we have persuasive nests now. Oh, what's going on here? Who is it? Oh, hi. Oh, it's you. You're not busy today. Are you? Hang out with me. Will you spend the day with I? Sure. Why not? 
Okay, I need to move this box from behind my head. Ooh. I also have really bad acid reflux problems. I My body is just killing me, honestly. That's how many problems I have. Yaskami High School Lockers, hello. I told you she would be right back. Yo. Hey Dovo, what you doing? At class had a presentation today, so we we're at the auditorium. Oh yeah, you guys are both on the basketball team, right? Hey, isn't I a Bihara your manager? Seriously, damn, now I'm jealous. <laughs> it's not like she comes to practice. And probably because she's always on the prowl for guys. Yeah, I heard she's pretty loose. And doesn't she look like What the fuck? The fuck is wrong with you guys? Oh my god, what the fuck is wrong with you guys? Jesus Christ! Holy shit! What the fuck is wrong with you? Stop them! It seems Cal is also offended. <sighs> Cut the crap, guys! You don't even know if that stuff is true. Yeah, that's right! Fuck off, everybody! Fuck the fuck off! Holy shit! Jesus fucking Christ, that was disgusting! Sorry. Sorry, Dovo, I know you and I, son, are pretty close, right? But those guys aren't usually that bad. Don't hold it against- I'll fucking hold it against them! Fuck those assholes! Fuck! Dude, fuck! Yeah, that fucking sucks. Rank up. Rank four. How the, when the fuck did we get to rank four? I'm gonna head home. And you're gonna walk with me. <laughs> okay. I'm fine with that, I guess. I fucking feel bad for her. Like, holy shit. Thank you! Okay, so I have no idea if there's even anything special going on today. It is the 15th. There is nothing else happening. That is not how I move around. I move around with the left stick. Let's check the fridge. Nothing. Good. Just how I like it. I gotta work on my diligence more though. Actually, I'm going to read. Thoroughly. I decided to read the gentle way with your full attention. Various. You. Your knowledge increased. Your expression is significantly increased. I'm really glad I'm reading this. I didn't think this would, like, do this much. I didn't think it increased my knowledge, too. That's fucking awesome. Oh, it's Yukiko. Good morning, Dovokun. Good morning, Yukiko. School camp starts- Oh my god, that's tomorrow? Fuck. We'll be in the same group, but what should we be cooking for dinner? Hey, why don't we get everyone and go buy ingredients after school? We should do that. Okay. I'll be sure to let Chie and Yosuke know then. And there's the running guy! The final boss! 
after school. Jeanette's grocery store department. He came with the others to buy ingredients for the cookout tomorrow. What do you put in curry again? Carrots, potatoes, onions, mushrooms, green peppers, and radishes? Maybe. Are radishes the same as turnips? No, they are not. They are apparently going to make curry. Curry's fine, right? It's practically our national food. We were going back and forth between ramen and curry, but I thought ramen might not be enough for you guys. Hmm, I wonder what kind of ingredients Yosuke likes. I, I get the feeling he's real picky. He's on another floor, isn't he? Do you want me to go ask? Ah, no need. Plus, he said he needed to get ready for something. Hmm. Hey, Chie, you use potato starch for curry, right? I have no fucking idea what you use for curry. Um, of course you do. <laughs> Otherwise, the sauce wouldn't thicken. No! We need wait! We potato starch and wait. some flour, too. Wait, 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 no. No, wait. Well, there are different kinds of flour. Oh, which should we get? Uh, all purpose? You use f oh. I only use flour to make stuff thicken. Hmm. Whole wheat sounds healthy. Let's get that one. And here they are. Chili peppers. It's not curry if it isn't spicy. Oh, well, let, let's just get everything that seems right. Oh, well, how about some kimchi, too? And, and some ground pepper. So far, this seems all right, which is surprising me. There's two kinds, though. Black and white. Like, it's not... Too bad. Oh, way to go, Yukiko. The Amagi family sure knows their stuff. Let's get both, just in case. Is this bad? Oh, yeah. We'll need some special ingredients, too, to spice things up. Hmm, I remember seeing something on TV about that. I no! Think no! It was oh, my God. Chocolate, coffee, yogurt. No. <gasps> oh, how about mint chocolate? I love that stuff. Oh, my fucking God. I don't put that in... Oh, I can drink mocha, so l let's get that. No, that's not what you put in curry. That should make the sauce taste better. No, no, you don't. No, you don't put. No, Th I played this part and I got so upset and I was like, I was like, what the fuck? Why are you guys putting fucking seafood in there? Why the fuck are you putting coffee and fucking chocolate and mint chocolate? What the fuck is wrong with you? Jesus. Jesus fucking Christ. That food is fucking terrifying. Like, I actually really like seafood. I've been actually craving, like, fish put, like, with lemon on it. Or lemon pepper or whatever. We're going to read it thoroughly. Knowledge increased. Expression increased. I wonder how many days it'll take for me to finish reading this. And the thing is today, right? Actually, it's raining all day today, it looks like. No, we know that's cloudy all day. Never mind. Today's the first day of school camp. You should hurry to the meeting place. School camp at dusk. Trash was murder on my back. I can't believe someone threw away an entire bike. Damn it, litterers should have to deal with their own garbage. Anyways, time for dinner. Man, I'm starving. Dude, the girls cook just for us. Not that I expect much out of Chie, but Yukiko's got the full tradition of the Amagi in behind her food. You know it's gonna be out of this world. You shouldn't eat it. 
I want to say you shouldn't eat it. I'll give you mine too. Huh? Why so generous all of a sudden? It's okay, man. Just enjoy. No, you don't understand. I can't wait to dig in. You're gonna die. Should we taste this? Uh, only if you do it first. Oh man, here it comes! Uh, sorry for the wait. Um... We put a lot of love into it. Whoa, really? That's kinda cliched, but still awesome! Okay then, chow time! Same. Uh, hey. What the hell is this? <laughs> I mean, what kind of <laughs> curry's supposed to be like really spicy or kind of mild? This just stinks. I mean, it's gritty too. It's somehow both gritty and slimy, and it's got squishy parts in it. It's so freaking nasty, I can't even swallow it! Well, it, it just didn't mix too well, but it does offer a wide variety of textures. <laughs> it's nauseating! Come on, it's not that bad. That's just your opinion. That's just my opinion! I'm telling you as a friend, don't do it. I wouldn't even joke about trying that slop. You're being looked at with expectation. Don't do it. Decline the offer. It's like you put it in your mouth. You sense that something is wrong. You can tell after one bite that this isn't edible. There's no way you can swallow it. You died. It's game over. We're sorry. Sorry. What are we gonna do? Our group's the only one without food. I mean, if it was even slightly edible, that'd be one thing. But I'm not taking another bite of this mystery food X. <gasps> Something smells good. Hey, uh, Hanako, you wouldn't happen to have any extra curry left, huh? Come on, give us some! We're begging you! We're starving to death here! No way! I'm on a diet right now, so this is all that I made. It has to last me. All that you made? It's like a bucket full. Oh, I wonder if there's any way we can get something delivered here. But our cell phones don't get service up here. And dinner time's almost over. All right, back to your tents. Men's tents are this way, and the girls' tents are that way. Come on, people, look alive! Youngsters like yourselves should hurry up and get to bed after they eat. It's now time for us teachers to have some boo. I mean, uh, after bed! Lights out! You guys are gonna pay for this. Uh huh. <laughs> Night! Yeah, if someone caused me to not get any food, I would be extremely angry. I would lose it. I'd be like, excuse me. You owe me many foods. Damn it. I'm so hungry. And how the hell did you end up here? My teach threatened to hold me back a year if I didn't show. And the first year's ten is all quiet. It's like someone died. 
Well, if you were in there with him, I'm not surprised. Is it just you two in this tent? The other guys called in sick. Smart move. So it's okay if I hang out here? Stay as long as you want, dude. Hey, you're a stand-up guy, senpai. Don't worry, I won't make any trouble for you. They won't catch me unless we raise a ruckus. All right, all right, you can sleep over there. Dude, there's a huge rock under there. How am I supposed to sleep? It hurt like hell. Pipe down! Didn't you say you weren't gonna make any noise? Yo, Senpai, can't you go just a little further back? Nope. There's a slope just past here. I'd roll down the hill in my sleep. If you don't like it here, go back to the first year tent. <laughs> hey, wasn't your teacher some guy called King Moron? That guy stopped me outside earlier and he pissed me off so bad I was about to lose it. He was going on and on about when I was in middle school. When he doesn't know shit about any of that. Not only that, he was bullshitting about how I'll be expelled immediately if I cause trouble. That ain't funny, man. Yeah, that guy set a speed record for jumping to conclusions. Check this out, right? I heard it from a guy in my class. He said that asshole was talking shit about the two girls who died. King Moron was talking about Ms. Yamano and Saki-senpai? Yeah, we were there. It was like, it's no surprise that people who are unfaithful or run away from home meet a bad end. I don't know, maybe he was exaggerating. Everyone seems to hate that son of a bitch Moraoka. Damn, I could just picture him saying that. He never shut up about me either when I moved here last year. Not that I remember anything he said. Even if it's only a little true, it still pisses me off. The dickhead's a damn teacher, for God's sake. Now, nah, don't waste your energy getting pissed at that clown. Yeah, you got a point. Wait a sec. What are you eating? Animal cracker? What the? Those are mine! Damn it! I was so pumped about finding the penguin today. Penguin? The secret animal cracker. You were eating them and you didn't know that? Are you serious? Well, you should have said something. Oh, well. Oh, this isn't going to fill me up. Let's just go to sleep. That's all you gotta say for yourself after taking my snacks. Kanji, don't you have more space on your side? And I can't sleep over there. Or my back's gonna break. Oh, okay. Uh, hey. Yeah? Why'd you come to this tent? I already told you. Jeez, wrong with you. This is as good a time as any, so I want you to be honest with us. Uh, okay. Are you really, you know? Am I really what? What I mean is, um... Are we going to be safe alone with you? What? What, what, the, what the hell is that supposed to mean? I already told you guys I'm not like that. Well, then why are you all hot and bothered about it? That's just more suspicious. Hell no! We settled this already, damn it. Right now I'm... Well, how do I put it? Uh... Oh god, don't trail off like that, you're freaking me out! I'm trying to tell you that I have no problem being around girls now. Can you prove it? <laughs> prove it? 
Because if you can't, we're going to be stuck here all night, half scared to death. To, to hell with this. If that's what you really think of me, then I'm going to go hit the girls' tent right now. Uh, wait, well, that's a little extreme. You don't have to go that far. They'll expel you if they find you. Don't tell me you forgot. King Moron's got his eye on you. Yeah, like that stop a man like me. Seriously going for it. Hey man, you gotta stop him. Okay, so first off, Yosuke's a fucking asshole. Yosuke's like, dude, dude, if you're really gay, I don't want you in this tent with us. Us in our fully clothed tracksuits sleeping together? I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this, man. It's kinda weird to me. I'm not gonna feel safe. I'm gonna be scared to death. Because of this one gay. This one gay. Who is our friend. Who's made it clear that he's like extremely thankful to us and wouldn't ever do anything to hurt us. This one person. That's what Yosuke is doing. Even if Kanji isn't actually gay. Like, obviously he's got his own shit going on. But... Not my problem. Well, you think I won't? To hell with King Moron! No one's stopping Kanji Tansumi, damn it! Yeah, it's not my problem. Yosuke, you hey, fucked up. Wait! What a putz. I declare myself not responsible for anything that happens. No, it is actually literally your fault, Yosuke. It is not my problem. I said it first. According to Nose Go's rules, you lost. Uh, now I get why we're the only three in here. I can't uh, sleep. Uh, I'm hungry too. I should have eaten a little uh, more of that curry. It might have knocked us unconscious. Uh, Sheesh, we can't sleep, we can't walk around. I wonder what Teddy's doing right now. Being alone all day is pretty rough when you think about it. You know, a while ago he... That does it! Yukiko, we're out of here! Where'd we go, though? I don't think climbing down the mountain is a good idea. Do you think she'd stop snoring if I covered her nose and mouth? Do you think she'd stop snoring if I yeah, kill her? No, 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 no. Yukiko, no! <laughs> Ugh, I can't take it anymore! Yukiko reminds me of Elham. Who's there? And that's Kanji. If King Moron finds out, we'll all be expelled. Go back to your tent. We can't. Are there any rotten apples out and about? Any indecent students out there? All right, hurry up and get in. So why are you two here? Well, it's Kanji Kun. He's out cold. Uh, I don't know what happened. He just came in and then and then, then he fainted all of a sudden. That's all. Right, Yukiko? Huh? Uh, yeah. So there was no way we could sleep with him lying there. And, and you know, if, if we woke him up, we might have made a fuss. That's why we left him there. What? That makes no sense. He busted into your tent, then suddenly fainted. Listen up! Being insolent 
and being indecent are very different things. It's him. He's right outside. Hey, turn the light off. Hey, are you two in there? Answer me! Huh? Ah, so you're in there. Is Hanamura already asleep? Yes, sir. Fast asleep, sir. Don't get cute, Hanamura. Shut up and go back to sleep. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh, you could have one too many. I'm so sleepy. <sighs> there goes a couple years off my lifespan. No joke. We were nearly expelled. This is you guys' fault. What else were we supposed to do? Anyways, we can't leave now. We'll sneak out before the others wake up tomorrow. Is that good enough for you? What are you so pissed off for? Hey, you better not try any funny stuff while we're asleep. Is that clear? Hey, we didn't say you could... Damn it. You owe us for this. Yeah, they messed up our food and they did this. You set up a barricade inside the tent. Using everyone's belonging. Everyone is cramped up in a tight space. Fun times.